you were two years and nine months when you asked me. But I was ready for it, had my answer all planned, knew exactly what I was going to say. We were at the deli counter of that little market on North Willow. You know, it's a giant movie theater now. And I was ordering a pound or, I don't know, five pounds of sliced yellow American because all you would eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner every day was grilled cheese. And I was convinced I was the worst mother in the world and you were totally malnourished. And I lived for the day when you would just take a bite of the carrot stick that I put on the plate. Anyway, there was this guy and he was with his little girl about your age. And she was singing the ABC song at the top of her lungs, which not for nothing, you were better at. I'm just saying that you were mesmerized by them. And that's when you asked, where's my daddy? It wasn't exactly the place I expected the question, but I had the answer. Baby, when I was 39 years old, all I wanted more than anything in the world was to have a little girl just like you. So I went to a doctor and he helped me become your mommy. And now it's just you and me. I really thought that was a brilliant answer. I mean, you were barely three. What I didn't think was that you would spend the next four or five, six forever years telling everybody that your father was a doctor. And today, today's your white coat ceremony, the first official day of medical school. We did good. You and me. I I made you a grilled cheese. Eat the carrots. <laughs>